the only time that African countries like Nigeria, South Africa, Kenya, and Egypt, including Rwanda, are not far. So this is the only industrial revolution that between the developed nations and the African countries, there is no any huge gap. It's a handshake. Yes, there is a handshake for sure. And it is because of the bridging the gap, at least uh, we are proactive in Nigeria, like the issue of 5G in which Mr. President has directed security institutions to immediately come up with initiatives on how to leverage on it and address security challenges. With 5G, you can have real-time communications. You will be able to do most of the security operations that are required. You will, can be able to have all the systems. You can have command system, communication system, computer system, control system. You need to you can have to space. Yes, the intelligence system. You can have information system surveillance system, recognizance systems, all of them you can have this with artificial intelligence, robotics, augmented reality, virtual reality, all. So it, this revolution is for security institutions to leverage on. And it is because of this we established the National Center for Artificial Intelligence and Robotics. And now we are proactive. Many developed countries are yet to have Center for Artificial Intelligence and Robotics, but we have it in Nigeria the first ever center on that in Africa, the first one. Recently, eight unicorns were announced in the digital economy sector. Six of them are from Nigeria. In Africa, six, eight. Six are in Nigeria, only two are in other countries. One in Senegal, the other one in Egypt. So it is because of this, at least uh, we are being proactive. Many developed nations do not have 5G today. But now we have auctioned the spectrum. I have handed over the spectrum just uh, last week to NCC. Most probably the deployment will commence soon. It is because of this I believe with uh, intellectual people like you in government, we would be able to make sure that that high check in the fourth industrial revolution will bring us very close to the developed nations so that from that morning, even in the fifth industrial revolution, we could behave like China, to be a new entry and at the same time at the forefront. In the, at the forefront. <laughs> uh, it's not easy, but with intellect, with great minds around, that is very possible, because some of the technological revolutions are only being uh, championed by few great minds, intellectual giants around. And I believe if this country is blessed with talent. What we need is to identify the talent, mentor them, harness what they have been doing, provide the enabling environment for them to make us proud. Uh, once again, thank you very much for being here. And I do hope that this is just the beginning of our relationship, not the end. The mandate between the agent, the administration, and that of the ministry are somehow interwoven. There are many things we can do together. And uh, in gov governance, synergy and collaboration are the key to success. Nobody can do it alone. I, I alone, I am nothing. With you and my colleagues, we become something. So it is because of this I do hope that after this visit, we will look at areas that we can support one another. We can work together to make our country very successful. And I want to use the opportunity to invite you, looking at how intellectual you are, to create time to visit the National Center for Artificial Intelligence and Robotics, go around through the center and see the facilities that are there, the great minds, our young innovators that are being brought there, the way we try to mentor them, provide the environment for them, to identify some of our problems in the country and come up with innovative solutions to that. And I believe you will be able to present some challenges uh, within the security cycle that we need our great minds to come up with some uh, super innovative solutions that will handle the challenge. So I personally invite you, uh, if you uh, look at your schedule, we will be appreciate to organize a visit for you so that you can... Uh, feel free to next week. Sir. Next week. Okay, that is great. Mokhtar, yes, please coordinate. Uh, liars, yes, with yes. Uh, uh, liars with him get the actual time.